energy, enthusiasm, and intensity. You need people that are going to bring you that. As a leader, there's a book called Leading on Empty, and it says those are in the business of giving out or wearing out. And so it's so important for you, for me. I have to surround myself with people. Uh, uh, yes, I feed a lot of people, and I give to a lot of people. And there's some people that are takers, meaning that they're not giving that back. And I try to reduce that contact there. Maybe you can't eliminate it. If you can't, eliminate it. But maybe you can't, so you just reduce it. You just don't make yourself available. You just, you're, you're, you're spending time somewhere else. I don't care where the energy comes from. What I care is that there's positive energy coming. I need to be around an environment that will want, when I walk in, our guys know we have a meeting uh, every Tuesday around 9, 30, 10 o'clock at night. We're finishing the night. We just had a big overview and I'll walk in. The moment I walk in, the entire team, hey, blah, blah, blah. And I, you know what that does to a leader? You walk in the room and you, the way that you're received, the way that you're welcome, it, you just want to give more to whoever you're around. So it's so important, the energy of the people that you choose to put around you, that they are feeding you. There's something about energy that can transform an environment. It doesn't matter if it's a church or a business or a family or anything, guys. Energy is so important. 